Hello and welcome to the Enchantress of Yelenak. We're here on my Enchanter, uh, as we've known to be called, Viva. Uh, it was a random name I picked, uh, but there we go. And uh, yeah, so what we're going to do today is we're going to get the st Stein of Magok. It is a uh, pretty nice little Stein, and uh, it's like 10 intelligence and a few other stats on it. But I need it to get my mana over a certain threshold so I can cast a spell. And uh, so what we're going to do is go ahead and start here. So we're in uh, Freeport, right here, East Freeport to be exact, uh, right here in this building right in front of us, the Seafarer's Roost. Uh, the guy we need to talk to to start this quest is right here. And this is an old style quest where it's just, you know, you hail the guy and you talk to him. And uh, he gives you some stuff. So let's go here. Gregor Nassen. Go ahead and hail him. All right. Sit down. Your name, your poison. I know we are lacking in originality, but I intend to create some exotic drinks. What kind of exotic drinks do you have? Interested in exotic drinks, are we? I am attempting to create some of these drinks I read about in this book I found. It was called the Bar Keeper's Compendium. <laughs> I will first need to get my hands on a few exotic ingredients. What exotic ingredients do you need? I desire a Keola note, an Eard's tonic, honey jome, and a cola. A fish. <laughs> if I could get those, I will no longer need to hold on to the barkeeper's compendium. Whoever returned the ingredients to me may have it. What about this book? I found the book amongst the, some garbage littering the ground in Freeport East. It appears to have been created by an ogre named Klurg. I am sure he wants it returned, but I will never part with it. That is, unless I get the few exotic ingredients I need to experiment with. All right, so he wants a Keola note, an Erd's tonic, a honey jump, and a uh, fish. <laughs> so all of these are in different parts of the world. So what we're going to do is we'll go get these items. The nut is in Ocean of Tears. The tonic is in Erden. The honey jump is in Misty Thicket. And the fish is in North Kinos. So we're going to head out there and start getting those. All right, in Misty Thicket right here on the northern part of the wall, either side, there's a bunch of Bixies that spawn. You can get the honeycomb for the honey jump right here. We're going to go inside of uh, River Val right now and turn in a honeycomb to get jump jump or honey jump. All right, we're inside a river valve. We're going to go inside one of these little uh, huts looking for Kizzy. Uh, mini top. Min top. <laughs> it's right here on the map in the southern part of the zone. You can see right there. Uh, if you come in from either of those other sides, it's right there. Fairly easy to find. Uh, what you do is you give her three honeycomb and it's two plat three platinum. And she will give you the honey jump we need so here we go there we go we have the honey jump and we are ready to go to the next stage of the quest all right we're right here in ocean of tears on the first island you land on after the translocator we're located right here in the south we need to find this lady right here cleo and we need to buy a keola nut so she sells them right here as soon as i find it there we go there's the nut really cheap and there we go so now we need to take this and go on to the next stage all right we're here in Kinos and uh, north I believe north Kinos to be exact uh, so what we need to do is get a colindil fish from this little pond right here at the temple of life so you can see that guy right out there that's drowning that is my uh, <laughs> that is my one character that I use to get the fish and you go in there you kill the fish with a level one character you take a massive faction hit and uh, you get the fish and you're done it's pretty simple uh, you can see here I'm uh, going in the water kind of showing where all the places place is 
But the fish spawns in here. It's a level one. You just gotta kill it. Uh, I didn't want to take the faction hit, so I made it alone. And there's the fish right there. And now we'll go to the next location. All right, for the last piece we need to collect, we need to get Erd's Tonic. It's located, the start of it's right here in a Blue Hawk's uh, Smithery, I think it is, or Bar. bar. I'm not 100% sure what this place is. Uh, but we go in right here. Uh, we talk to him, and we look for Inarook's Curse. We buy a bottle of that. And then uh, take that, and we go into the library and hand it in. So we're going to go up this way. Library is conveniently right outside. We just need to go in here, flip around the corner, and uh, she is located on the top floor. So it's just a matter of finding <laughs> finding the way to go up. There we go. And uh, there she is, right there. Uh, Sing Sinkin Highbrow. Uh, I think I I do an alliance spell right here. Uh, so so she likes me a little bit better. I don't know if it matters. I didn't try otherwise. But we hand her the Enerex Curse. There we go. And we get Erd's Tonic, which is the last piece we need to uh, get the Stein. Alright, we're back here in Freeport. Same guy right here. We've collected all the items. We have the fish, the honey gem, the tonic, and I bought 11 nuts for some reason, but uh, yeah. So let's go ahead and hand these over to him, one by one. Let's bring that right there, like a so, and boom. There we go, we get the barkeep compendium, which now we can take to uh, Oglock. See, he says, I never close, closed it before, it is useless to you. I have no need for it any longer. Maybe you can return it to Clerg for some type of reward. Clerg? I don't know. No, ask an ogre. They may have heard of him. All right. So there we go. We're done here in Freeport. We're going to head down to Oglock, the ogre city, and turn in the rest of this. All right. I am here in Oglock. So, so here's the entrance from Ferrot. You walk like this. You go all the way around. You go through here. And you come back all the way back here, and here is Clerg. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna talk to him. Uh, I am in I am an enchanter, so I can use a uh, ogre illusion and become beautiful. But uh, here we go. Uh, say hello, friend. Have a drink. I have some unique drinks. Try one, and remember, you get rowdy. The brown bouncers will crush you. What unique drinks? I've been all over Norath, and even served some of the very great barkeeps in Freeport. I am the creator of the Flaming Clerg and Ogre's Swill. Barkeeps in Freeport? Yes, I have journeyed to many taverns, but it was Freeport that I acquired most of my art. I compiled all my drinks and recipes in a special book. What book is that? Find ways to help Ogre, and then we'll have a calm help them. What? Let's see Khan. Do I not have a faction? One second here. The Flaming Kurg. Flaming Kurg was my greatest cre creation. It brought me great respect in Oglock. Unfortunately, I've heard tales of, of an imposter drink. Find ways to help. <laughs> okay, he doesn't like that. All right, we can use uh, Benevolence to raise our faction even more. So now we're amably, we work kindly. So let's see how this goes here. Special book. I compiled all my drinks into one book. I lost the book while in Freeport, no doubt. Some barkeep is experimenting with it. I would pay dearly for someone to return it to me. Well, 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 buddy, we got it right here. So here's his barkeep book. Go and hand that over. There we go, and we have acquired the Stein of Magok. Uh, he also says, Ah, oh, my barkeep compen comp <laughs> compendium has returned. I am in your debt. I do not like to be in any man's debt. Let me offer you this as a payment for your great service. Obtaining my book could not have been a simple task. There we go. But uh, there it is. Let's go ahead and uh, dual do wield steins there. Hopefully that gives me enough mana to cast the spell I want to cast. 
this up to 167 intelligence. It's a pretty nice little thing for the amount of effort, right? It took me, uh, the hardest part about if this was getting ports and I, all I had to do was ask in OOC in the commons for anybody to trade a clarity for a port and I was instantly ported. <laughs> so, uh, that's kind of nice. So let's see here, 10 HP, 10 intelligence, 25 disease resist and five dexterity. Pretty nice little uh, item, if I do not say so myself. Uh, but that's that, that's the quest, that's the Stein of Magak. Uh, we are done, and we are uh, gonna get out of here before these guys kill us. They hit hard, <laughs> I must say. They hit pretty, pretty hard. All right, let's go ahead and get a screenshot right there. But uh, yeah, if anybody has any questions, I missed anything, please let me know, and uh, I'll explain it in the comments but thank you very much for watching have a fantastic day